Manchester United have beaten LA Galaxy 5-2. We've beaten Rail Salt Lake 2-1. But on Thursday night out in America, we play Manchester City. The first Manchester derby to happen outside of England. It's definitely going to be the hardest game Man United have played so far this summer. Pep Guardiola has made some good signings already this summer. Man United have signed Lindelof and Lukaku, but who will start for Jose Mourinho? He's been tinkering and switching so far. 3-5-2 in the first game, more of a 4-2-3-1 in the second game. What formation would he use and who will start? Here is my predicted 11 for that game against Man City. Now, Sergio Romero will probably start in goal. We've had De Gea in the first game, Pereira in the second game. So, if he's switching around, Romero should start this game. He was in the goal second half against Real Salt Lake and made some decent saves. Now, right back, Antonio Valencia got sent off against Real Salt Lake. I don't actually know whether that means he's suspended and whether that actually works in friendlies. I don't think he is. But in this one, I'm going for Twanzebe to play right back. Fosu Mensah's had a little bit of time there. Twanzebe had a little bit of time as well, I think, in the first game. Not sure. But I'm going to play him in this one. Let me know what you think about that. Centre-back partnership, I'm going to keep saying it until I see it. Eric Bailly and Viktor Lindelof. Perfect game to try them in up against elite-level opposition, the sort of opposition that Man United are going to be playing next season in the Premier League, not LA Galaxy and Real Salt Lake. Although Real Salt Lake caused us lots of problems in that game. Um, I'm going for those two as a centre-back partnership. I don't want to see Jones or Smalling. I want to see these two in action. Now, at left-back, I've gone for Demetri Mitchell. Uh, Daley Blind started in the, first, in the second game, sorry. First game, can't remember who started left back, but it wasn't Demetri Mitchell. I think he's very, very good. I think he's... Last year he got converted into a left back and he needs to prove himself against tough opposition. Perfect game for that to happen, for Mourinho to sort of test and see how good he is in that position. Now, midfield three, I've gone for Ander Herrera, Paul Pogba and Andreas Pereira, who has surprised everybody really by playing two games and the tour as a number six sort of defensive midfielder. I don't really think that's his position. I, don't, I like to think he won't play there much next season. I think he's more of a number eight, more of, more of a number 10 even. Someone who plays advanced as a midfielder. So whether or not he plays sort of at the base of a V with Ander Herrera and Paul Pogba in front of him, or maybe Ander Herrera sits deep and Pereira plays alongside Pogba. I don't know, but what would you like to see? Let me know about your thoughts on that midfield trio. Maybe you'd like to see Fellaini in there for some bizarre reason. Maybe you'd like to see Michael Carrick start there as well. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And for a front three, I've gone for Henry Mkhitaryan, Jesse Lingard and Romelu Lukaku. Now, Jesse Lingard started both games on tour and has arguably looked like probably our best player on tour. Certainly looks like one of the fittest and one of the brightest. And I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't play this game because it's the pre-season friendlies. You switch and you change. But Mourinho's clearly got a soft spot for Lingard. He likes what he does as a player, likes what he adds to attack as well as defence. So I think we could see Lingard start in this game as well. Now I put Henry Mkhitaryan in, who doesn't usually play on the left wing, so maybe this is a bit of a, a poor choice and we'll see Anthony Martial start there instead, who has also played very well so far this tour, just as Mkhitaryan has. He's scored in both games. Martial and Mkhitaryan both looking sharp. Who would you start out there on the left? Up front, I've gone for Romelu Lukaku. It might be Marcus Rashford coming back in and Marcus Rashford would start, but it doesn't really matter who you see, Rashford or Lukaku, because in the second half, it's going to be the other one. So maybe we should save Rashford for when City's legs are a little bit more tired. That's when he can expose them a lot. But that's my predicted start 11 for the game against Man City. Who would you start? There's lots of changes you can make, and I'm probably going to be wrong in about 6 out of 11 positions, because it's impossible to predict the predicted 11 for a pre-season friendly. It's just ridiculously hard. But let me know what you think in the comments below. Who do you want to see start up front? Rashford or Lukaku? Would you like to see Carrick start in midfield, maybe instead of Pereira? Let me know in the comments below. As always, drop a like on the video, ladies and gentlemen, and subscribe down there if you are new to the channel. Until next time, take it easy.